So Will Smith started vlogging, and let me tell you, I'm pumped. I love Will Smith. I've loved Will Smith back from when he was the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, but I really started to like him when I started to hear him in interviews. Will Smith always shares really remarkable insights when it comes to motivation and pursuit. One of my favorite quotes from him was actually this. Essentially, he said, if we're both getting on the treadmill, I'm gonna tell you one thing. You're getting off that treadmill first or I'm dead. And what's funny about that is that I've always felt that way about myself too. There's nothing that's gonna stop me from getting what I want. And when I see Will Smith, or saying this anyway in this interview, it just made me get fired up. And I actually did a video about this probably a couple of years ago now. But now, things changed. Will Smith started vlogging, and I've got some comments about it. Hey, I'm Derek Halpern. You're watching Planet Derek, the place entrepreneurs come to get ahead in business and in life. And here's what I think about Will Smith vlogging. I love it. So Will Smith did a vlog where he quoted John C. Maxwell, fail early, fail often, fail forward. Then he goes on to share what he believes about failure. Nowadays, people like to view failure as, some, as something negative. It's so bad, in fact, that we've decided that people don't fail anymore. Everyone gets a trophy. And it's so weird because, on the one hand, failure does make you feel bad. But there's nothing bad about feeling bad. And Will Smith goes on to say that failure for him is important because the more you fail, the more you learn, the more you learn, the more you go forward. But for me, I've always appreciated doing things poorly and I've always appreciated feeling bad about it because in that discontent, in that feeling, is where the desire and motivation comes to become better. This is something I feel is lost on kids today. It's lost on people today. We're so focused on being so nice to people that no one is ever actually willing to give people the real feedback they need to proceed forward. When I first started speaking, by now you know, I wasn't very good. I've showed you a video of it. I wasn't a great speaker. I remember I got off stage, my buddy Lewis Howes comes up to me and he gave me some feedback. And he didn't say it to demean me. He didn't say it to make me feel bad about myself. But what he said is, hey, dude, I like some of the content. You need to get a little bit better at presenting it. Real, honest feedback. Now, what's funny is I already knew I kind of bombed it because I felt like the audience wasn't kind of engaged as much as I wanted them to be engaged. But hearing that gave me that wherewithal to proceed forward. For some reason, people today, they don't want to hear stuff like this. They just want to be told how great they are. They want to be told, oh, I sent this email and I got this result. So you called it in. It's a half-assed email. I said this to a friend, they got insulted at me. And I was just like, I don't know why you're insulted. Good email, good results. It wasn't that great. There's nothing wrong with that. You don't need everyone to give you these compliments so you feel good about yourself. And this brings me to failure. Not everything you do is gonna be great. If you look at some of the videos on this channel, some of the videos are good, some of the videos aren't good. Each bad video has been a learning experience for me to make better videos. Now, this brings me back to Will Smith. I'm pumped that he's vlogging because, as I said, I've seen some interviews with him and some of the things he's said have really inspired me personally. And now we're gonna be seeing him create more of this stuff, what? I'm pumped. So if you haven't seen his vlog, you need to go check it out. Go subscribe. And today, all I want to say is this. Sometimes you're going to fail at something and you're going to feel bad about yourself. But the most important thing you can do is wake up the next day, see that failure, and use that as fuel to go forward. I'm Derek Halpern. If you like this video, like it. Subscribe to my channel. I'll see you tomorrow.